both went right there as well because I had a painting company when I was in college. How'd that work out? Um, it was good. It was good. It was uh, it was a student painting company, and I did that for a couple of years um, when I was in college when I was playing football. But then I had to stop doing both because it was just too much work. Mm. And um, so I decided to go like go out, work on my business, and try to make money. Um, first, I didn't because I you know I didn't know what what was what what working was uh -huh. so like i just thought like okay like shit's gonna happen and then i'm gonna be rich <laughs> right i don't have to i don't have to do shit idea. i don't have to do anything <laughs> different and then right. everything's gonna work out and 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 uh i'm gonna be rich and it turns yeah. out it doesn't work that way <laughs> right, right. Yeah. so so after, after that i had to grind and i was like doing door-to-door -door marketing to get leads to to paint people's like porch So you're just um, knocking doors. Yeah, That's and then a good business. Well, it's you good. Learn how to sell. I mean, you can do and, anything. And and um, so I started to do that. Then I was hiring high school kids to work to do door to door for me. Mm -hmm. At some point, I had 15 or 20 kids doing door to door. Nice. Um, and I was paying them like $15 for like a name and email of people that wanted to. I wanted to have like a paint job during the summer, so I was calling those people at night and. I was booking estimate in the oh. weekend. So you didn't just pay them on commission. You also paid them just for yeah. signing things up. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Cool. yeah. It was nice. Yeah. It was nice. And then, uh, and then during the summer, I was hiring, uh, you know, like, again, high school kids, college kids to do my projects. All right. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you know, they got to have some money. Yeah. They're, they're I know. Going to school, so. I know. And uh, the cool thing is I... I Um, I had like 10, uh, you know, at some point, like those two, like two teams of painter, two or three teams of painter, like two, two guys, three guys per team. Cool. The second year I did a hundred and something thousand. And uh, the last, the last year that I did it was um, close to 150 or, 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 or 180K in revenue. Just gross. Yeah, just gross. Okay. But then, you know, at 20, It seemed wild for me to do that kind of like to to to, what was your percentage? to produce that kind of money. What, what was your percentage in that? Oh, uh, not good. No, <laughs> not good. I blew all of the money. On what? On, on not quoting the project right. Mm. On people not working. Uh, fast so it wasn't enough. like you were spending it. You were just no, no, no. I, I didn't spend it I, back in. I wasn't going to the casino. So and, you're and underbidding your work. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was. I was a kid. I, I, yeah, I needed yeah. to learn. Right. And uh, apparently, you learned while uh, fucking up. So, and I yeah. did. <laughs> it hey, trashed my learned. It trashed my credit for a while. Oh uh, no! Yeah, man. Yeah, because I got after like it was hard because uh, you know I had to learn to work. So like I didn't know, so I was super lazy. So I got in trouble, and then I didn't have any money, and then yeah. and I was like, yeah. Hey, at some point, I had to borrow like 100 bucks to fill up my van of gas. Because uh, to do it, to to go on the actual job site because I was wait, I was waiting on, on fucking checks to to clear or whatever. Right. And uh, yeah, that was wild. That's crazy. But then, so um, you had to move on. You said forget had to, it. Yeah, had to yeah. move on. And then I worked, and then uh, I became uh, I became a sus well, somewhat successful uh, real estate agent in Montreal. And then I moved here, mm -hmm. and then uh, talking. Yeah. <laughs> nice man. <laughs>